rigid. Three, two, one. So, depending on how good your heel stretch is, that really like dictates if you can do a um, bow and arrow. But for the people who really want to do bow and arrow and have a good heel stretch, um, there are multiple ways you can go about doing it. So, one way if your bow if you haven't had your bow and arrow and you want to get your bow and arrow and your heel stretch is to the point where you feel like you can pull it, a good way to do it is to hit a heel stretch. Grab your foot with both hands and pull it up here. And that way, all you have to do is let go with one hand and pull through. So you can go five, six, seven, hit one, pull three, through five, hold seven, clean one. Very simple. I obviously cannot do it with this leg, but we can try. Five, six, seven, hit one, pull three, through five, clean seven. <laughs> uh, but. I guess since, and then if you want just fun ways to do it, you can hold like this, push to the top, and then hit. Or you can throw your foot sideways, catch, straight up and through. So, clap. High five, down seven, two, three. And you saw my hand get stuck, but. Yeah. And then for scorpions slash needles, um, there are multiple ways to do it. Um, if you just want to practice the stretch, you can do a Superman, which is kind of what lower levels do. So you can grab it and just push the top and just look forward to your Superman. Make sure your leg is locked and you're really stretching those muscles. The way that I pull it is kind of hard to like explain. I don't know how I learned how to do it like this. But this hand, so same hand, same foot, and you grab on the inside of your foot, close to your other leg, and then pull to the top, grab the, grab with your other hand, like this, and then switch hands to let you up. So inside, grabbing your ankle, pull to the top, so you can grab with your other hand like so, pull through, wiggle down and pull. and i recently got my needle like when i say recently i mean last night I, got, I was working on it and i pulled my needle so i guess now i can do it and it's really cool But if I'm not mistaken, that's pretty much it. Hey guys, just so you know, I'm not a professional. I'm not. I'm obviously not a coach, but this is something I've been doing for a couple of years now, and it's something that I worked really hard on. And these are the techniques that helped me to get to where I am today. Um, so some of the stretches I do, you don't really need to do like all the counts, but it just helps me, and that's what I prefer. But honestly, just doing your heel stretches, throwing them, and repeatedly doing them over again multiple times a day is really what's going to stretch that muscle and get it used to being pulled and really, you know, help that flexibility. So um, that's all I got to say. Please like and subscribe, and remember, always be awesome and don't forget to have fun. Bye, guys.